How's it going everybody? It's your boy homie G and I'm back. Okay, so this video is by request. A little homegirl asked me, homie G, can you please do a video uh, for me? And I said, sure, what about? Well, I'm feeling uh, pretty bad because I see my ex um, around school. He's really sad um, because I broke up with him. And I was wondering if you can help me out with that. I said, okay, why not? So if you are in a relationship and you break up, I'm gonna tell you right now, okay? Love can be harsh. Feelings will be hurt. Okay, that happens. It's normal part of being in a relationship. When you break up, someone's feelings are going to get hurt. Okay, so if you are on the side of having been the one to break up with the person, some, some people uh, in this case will feel a little bit guilty, like they're the bad guy. Uh, and some people will be fine, you know, just move on and be like, oh, well, you know, I had to, I had to do what I had to do. I had to break up for whatever reason, and they'll be unfazed. Right. But some people do get, you know, pretty upset by it uh, in seeing their their ex, you know, moping around the school, you know, like a sad puppy, um, all sad and depressed. And that affects them. So this video is for you. First of all, I want to tell you that if you are in a relationship, it is worse to stay with someone just to spare their feelings, not breaking up with them. Um, will actually make you more miserable staying in that relationship just because you don't want to hurt their feelings. Um, and you know if they're sensitive that when you break up with them, they're going to be mightily upset and sad and depressed. You know, that might make you hesitant to break up with that person, but you have to go through with it anyways. So that's my number first suggestion is for you to go through with it anyways, because otherwise you're the one that's going to be miserable in that relationship. So don't stay with someone just to spare their feelings, okay? Number two, by breaking up with them, get this, you're actually giving them a chance to find someone that truly likes them for who they are, okay? So think about it like you're doing them a favor by breaking up with them. I know it seems maybe a little bit messed up, but it's the truth, okay? If that person wasn't a fit for you, there's someone else in this world uh, for that person and you have to give them the opportunity to find that person and you're not staying with them Okay, you get that so you're actually doing them a favor when you break up with them If you think about it that way, you'll feel less guilty less uh, uh, You know sad about it and you won't feel like the bad guy. Okay, number three Okay, you have to understand that you are not responsible for anyone else's feelings Okay, you're not Every person is responsible for their own feelings. And if he or she feels sad about having been broken up with, that's really on them for them to, you know, handle their own emotions. It's part of life and everybody has to go through with it. I mean, you've probably seen plenty of movies where, you know, someone got broken up with and they're dealing with it. Well, they have to go through with that. They have to learn how to deal with breakups. So, um, you're not responsible for how they feel. You're responsible for how you feel. And if you were, again, uh, in a bad relationship or in a, rela in a relationship where the person wasn't a fit for you and you were miserable or you just didn't like being in that relationship, those are your emotions. So you're responsible for your own emotions. If you're not happy, you're responsible to make yourself happy. And if that means breaking up with the other person, then so be it. Unfortunately, again, it's up to them to deal with their emotions. It's not up to you. And the last one, it's it's better, it is better to realize that the relationship isn't going to work, right? And break it off, than do something uh, more immature, like cheat on the person, and that person will find out that you cheated on them, and that'll make it a lot worse. So never stay with someone, um, and then just you know get someone on the side just to make yourself feel happy, it's better, the more mature thing to do is to break it off and end it that way versus cheating on the person because again, you, didn't really, you don't really like them and you want to, you know, have a different uh, relationship and, you know, you do that, you do that on the, on the slide there, on the slide, uh, it's not mature. So it's better to break it off entirely and then go seek, you know, a better relationship for yourself not while you're with someone else. So it's more mature to do it that way to end it. Okay. Those have been my four tips for you. And don't forget to like this video 
and hit me up for any other video uh, request. And I'm out. Peace.